Hi, I'm Frankie, and this is Dakota, and we're doing a late night cravings milk and mush review of, as you can see, drumstick cereal. Yes, not drumsticks like the ice cream, drumsticks ice cream brand cereal. Yeah, that was a mouthful. Um, as much as I want to save it, we're going to start with the vanilla one because I'm not a fan of mint and mint can be a little strong and stay on the palate for a little bit. I, I mean, I better like when I open this, just get like wafted with the... I hope so. I really hope these cocoa nuggets taste like the actual crunch. I need them to have like the Ooh. peanut in there. This is what I'm missing from this, I feel like. What's well, I mean... Maybe at, we... at least for me, I like the peanuts on my drumstick, so I'm I do too. Sad if no you don't get your nuts? Yeah. Can you get your you nuts? have my nuts? <laughs> Small bowl Frankie. Not too big. Oh god. <sighs> I like that was just like a little bit more. Here, you know what? You know what? We can still save ourselves. Still, you know, just we're still good. We're still good. See? Ooh. Um, you cheated. I'm sorry. I, I needed to try it. It's a milk and mush it. review. Okay. I think you need to put a little bit more in yours. Yeah. 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 Come on. Come on. They, they don't even see it. They're just like, it's a secret. <laughs> it's a secret, guys. You guys don't get to see it. Gotta even it out. <laughs> okay. And then, close that off. So, the little waffle ones. They're cone cereal pieces. This is what I was most curious about because the like waffle part oh, of the cereal, the yes, is my absolute favorite. Oh, oh, yes, yes, I can do that. It's my absolute favorite part of the cone. And when it starts to kind of get a little soggy in your mouth and, <laughs> and as you're eating the ice cream, it's just, it's my absolute favorite, so. I just like that it's it's how they represented Getting the drumstick in here was uh, each flavor is basically a different cereal completely. Yeah, like these I've kind of. Oh jeez. Yeah. No, no, you don't. You really, yeah, you really don't. Most cereal <laughs> the places kind of usually just stick with one the design one and we're basic just like. Cereal. And then most of the time, it's usually also the same color half the time. Yeah. But, so, so if we really look at this, it's like we have a cookie crisp type cereal yeah. for these ones and then you have these kind of make me think of cinnamon toast toast crunch mixed with like the uh, they look like golden like, snacks to me or... yes oh see i don't eat those very often i didn't even think of those, mm, those and then these favorites. make me think of cocoa puffs yeah yeah classic cocoa puffs mm -hmm. i need to try these by itself too i'm sorry i can't believe you how could you yeah pasta cocoa puff that's definitely what that Looks like to me. <clears throat> Are you ready to pour the milk? I am ready to pour the milk, yes. And that's another thing I'm actually excited about is the uh, cereal milk um, <clears throat> you'll get from this. Because cereal always kind of uh, generally flavors the milk. And it being a, a um, ice cream flavor, I think it'll be really nice if it does flavor the, the um, milk. Because you'll just be drinking ice cream at that point. Is it focused now? Yeah. Okay, we're good. I'm sorry, I'm not the steadiest of persons. I yeah. try really Did hard to. I just. Oh, there's enough. Okay. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try one of these. <laughs> but I want them to. What? I turned it. I, I, I turned the. <laughs> All the drumsticks in the world, yes. Not just drumsticks, but fairy life. Oh, oh, I thought you were talking about drumstick. I would this milk drumstick is good. Is Even though it's not milk, or it's made with real milk, but it's not milk. It's lactose free. Okay, so this vanilla one by itself is what I would have liked the Fruit Loops to taste like. Yeah? Yeah, this is definitely, I would have much rather the Fruit Loops tasted like that. It's not bad. I don't know if it tastes like drumsticks but it's just a lot of a lot of flavors smacking me in the face it definitely is it's kind of like you get like this little hit of cocoa this little hit of vanilla 
And then you get different texture too, I feel like, cause you get the vanilla ones, which are kind of like, they're just a little bit more of a soft chew. And then the Cocoa Puffs have this nice, like just that snap of a little crunch to them. And then you have those graham cracker crunch type seeds. Man, just each bite is just like a new delightful, like plunge into just it the sure cereal. Is. I'm like, I really, really like it. This is definitely this makes a me good one. like makes me pretty hopeful for the uh, mint chocolate chip. Or it's just mint chocolate. Yeah, because I feel like if they don't overpower the mint. Yeah, because it doesn't taste like the vanilla is very overpowering. No, but it gives it a nice subtle like sweetness to it and a little bit of a, a change from that cocoa. Because I feel like if the vanilla wasn't in there, that cocoa would just be way too overpowering. Because the waffle cones, I don't feel like have too much of a flavor. They more give like that, that, that texture. That texture, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Now it comes for the uh, the milk. We gotta taste the milk. Oh, do we need to finish the whole thing? We can do first. Mm, it was like a little vanilla, little cocoa. Yeah, I feel like it kind of made the milk a little creamy, honestly. Yeah. Like it thickens the milk a little bit. I think, well, ultimately for the drumsticks, just the classic vanilla, that's a thumbs up Definitely for the late night cravings. Yes. Definitely buy it. Now no. we're going to go into not one of my favorite choices of ice cream flavors, but the mint chocolate. It's not chocolate chip, it's just chocolate. All right. I wonder what kind of smells we're gonna I mean, get. Because that one didn't have much of a smell. No. Mint kind of has that, like. Well, yeah, you smell. can definitely. Mint has a very distinct smell. Ooh, oh, come on, box. These cereal boxes. It's always that side of the box for you. <laughs> Seems to not be your friend. Mm -mm. It's your weak side. <laughs> It doesn't smell, smell like mint, but it smells like, different than that box. Doesn't see what I mean? Like it I'm just, not gonna lie, guys, it smells like cardboard to me. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm getting from it. <laughs> I'm not the one making the messes. It was me this time. Put both of these off to the side right here. And let's get this nice shot of the milk being poured into our cereal. So everybody likes a little milk pouring. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Wait, I need milk too, man. I'm trying to give you your lid even though oh. we have two lids somehow. That's because we have the other thing of milk. Shh, they don't know that. But we've eaten a lot of cereal. I like milk. I like a lot of milk. <laughs> what if Actually, they don't they know this is one video? How do they know we've eaten more? I'm sorry. <laughs> Still not no, no smell really coming from it. <laughs> it doesn't make me that excited for it. But I was hoping to turn my milk green. If I'm being honest with you. First bite into it. I don't taste any mint. I'm gonna eat one by itself. It's like a light flavor, like it was like almost there but then it just kind of disappeared out of nowhere and then it was just kind of regular cereal honestly 
the real things that shine are these like graham cracker or whatever the cone pieces and the chocolate pieces honestly the flavor that the ice cream really don't even come out on either the vanilla i think really only comes out because I don't know. I feel pretty. like uh, most cereals kind of has that vanilla-ish flavor to it if it's like plain anyways. So I don't feel like that the vanilla really showed itself too much. But I feel like if you ate just the vanilla pieces by itself, you got a little bit more flavor. But I feel like with these mint pieces, there's not... There's just not a flavor to them to me. It's just yeah. a regular cereal. It's just... Normal. Meh. You know, uh, something I, I, I've noticed different... This this particular cereal, out of uh, other cereals I've eaten, gets soggy quite quickly. Mm -hmm. Except for those waffle cone pieces. I think they should make a cereal of just the waffle cone pieces. Drumstick. <laughs> Drumstick listening? waffle cones. <laughs> that's how they. You just that's how they get to make in the cereal market. Just the waffle cones. Great idea. Great. Fantastic. Mm. I'm still kind of salty that it's not turning my milk green. If I have green cereal or colored cereal, I want there to be a tinge of color to my milk when I go to drink it. I'm just saying. <laughs> so how do you feel about this one? I don't feel they hit the mark on their flavor. It tastes good. I like the textures of the cereal. Um, I definitely enjoy that combination of multiple cereals in one bite, but I definitely don't feel like there's much flavor besides the little cocoa puffs. The milk oddly kind of It's a very minty. sweet. I don't feel like it tastes minty. This, maybe Slight. I just don't taste mint. Like very subtle. No, I just get a very sweet taste from it. Mm. I haven't gotten mint in like any of these bites. It tastes good. Um. I'm going to give it a thumbs down for a late night cravings only because it didn't hit what you said, uh, what flavor you're going for. At least with the, the classic vanilla, you're still basically getting your classic vanilla. Yeah. But this one, I don't feel you even. So attempted. I'm going to have to disagree with your thumbs down, though. Not like on the mint. I just like I agree with your thumbs down on the classic vanilla though. I no, I like, we we, we oh did we the did thumbs. yes we did okay just kidding. Just be purely like this would totally be a late night cravings for me for the texture of everything. I would totally be down to like have a bowl of this purely to have mm. all the different textures going on. Yeah, and just like a sweet treat. You know yeah. what this might actually make really good. Cereal bar. Oh yeah, to do like a marshmallow cereal bar. Yeah. Yes, I think this I would feel be like a good. It being especially that it has the three different cereals. Yeah. I, I think that would be a very interesting uh, thing to try out. Hmm. Well, guys, that's our review on our lovely drumsticks cereals. We uh, gave you our opinions on which one you should buy and then which one yeah. you don't have to. Think about it. <laughs> Next time, we'll have either some more late night cravings for you, and hopefully they won't be different than cereal. <laughs> Bye, guys. So, one of the thing I, I feel like when they're in the chemistry lab and they're making the, the recipe, like the, the lab cook guy, he comes out and he's like, "Hey, here's mint chocolate drumstick," and they're mm -hmm. like, "Oh, it tastes like toothpaste." Like, oh. <laughs> okay, so he goes back. And he makes another recipe, and he turns down the, you know, the, the mint down 20%. He mm -hmm. comes back. He's like, what does this taste like? And he's like, it tastes like toothpaste. So then he goes back, and he cranks it down again. And pretty soon, there's just like a drop of mint <laughs> in the whole like vat. And they're mm -hmm. like, yeah, this tastes pretty yep, good. Yep, yep, yep. And that's how you get mint chocolate drumstick that doesn't taste like mint. I, I really feel like that's what it is. This must have been somebody that had super sensitive... Um, like heightened taste buds to taste every pure ingredient that goes into this and that mint just was so strong for them but <laughs> yeah. I definitely 